In this ever-expanding digital age and with the emergence of AI, there is a West Des Moines business that's leaving a mark, literally, and doing it the old-fashioned way. Yeah, how about some uh, pen to paper, kids? <laughs> Have you heard about this unique concept? Uh, it is showing <laughs> us the uniqueness of the written word. WHO 13's Roger Riley has his story. Quill and Nib, this is Rob. It's a busy morning at the Quill and Nib, a store devoted to the written word, that is, the handwritten word. A lot of people just like to write, and more of them are, I think, getting back to writing over computers now because it's just, when you're writing, it, it just slows your hand down, but it slows your thought process down. Rob Beers owns the quill and nib, referring to writing instruments from the past. Quill was a feather, and the nib is a pointed part on a fountain pen. That little pointed end, that metal end. Beers not only sells fountain pens, he makes them. Beers cuts pre-inlaid wood to fit the other pieces of the pen. He then sells the pens he makes in the store. $68 up to about $500. Wow. I've been trying to figure it out for 19 years, and it's ditch diggers to brain surgeons, as I say. For real high-end pens and ads, there's turned from a solid block. As far as buying a pen, find something that feels good in your hand, fits your budget, uh, meets your needs as far as how it looks. Looking back at his early years, Beers did not imagine his future would be in pen making. First time we had to write our name in cursive in the third grade, my teacher got one paper with a stick drawing of a dog on it. That was mine. <laughs> She said, why did you do that? I said, because I don't want to learn how to write. Beers says his days making pens may come to a close soon. He turns 79 next month. From Valley Junction in West Des Moines, Roger Riley, WHO 13 News. Thank you for that story, Roger. Beers says lots of people come into his store, but he also ships his pens all over the world that he makes by hand because they're very unique.